What's going on guys, David J. Woodbury here, and today I'm gonna to be doing an update on Landerbold. About a year or so ago, I did an update about doing landing pages and building landing pages in a couple seconds using Landerbolt. It's a platform that I use to build out tons of different landing pages. And I'm bringing this up because I've had a lot of, a lot of interest in those videos lately. Um, I, I've had a lot of people asking questions about Landerbolt and what it does and stuff like that. And they've added some new features actually since last year. So I just kind of wanted to go over that and, and show you how it works now. Uh, I believe this is like the 2.0 version. So the, the one I showed you guys last year was like the 1.0. Um, they've made some updates. Last year you could not upload zip files of your website. So um, any of you guys that are inside of my affiliate master files program, you guys can upload those. Uh, landing pages that I provide in there, for, you know, on Landerbolt instantly. So it's really quick and then you can edit those once they're uploaded. But I'm just going to kind of show you how to get started. Once you sign up for Landerbolt, you'll want to add a domain. I've been using Dynadot. Dynadot's super cheap, $8.99 for .coms, if that's what you're going for. In this case, I'm going to be adding one that's a .io. Dynadot gives you the, fr the privacy for free included, whereas GoDaddy is what I used to use. So I'm kind of migrating over. GoDaddy would charge another $10. Uh, per domain for the privacy. So $8.99 opposed to $17.99 on GoDaddy plus the $9.99 for privacy. So I was almost paying $30 a domain over at GoDaddy and it's only $8.99 on Dynadot. So check that out. I'll leave a link down below. Um, but what you want to do is uh, just grab the domain you want to add into Landerbolt here. And we just want to come into domains on the side when you're logged in and we'll just put our domain in here, click add domain. And then it's gonna give us the name servers that we wanna add on the registrar side. So I'll show you how to do that really quick here. So you'll notice here that uh, you'll get this message, the domain was created successfully, but we need to add these name servers inside of our registrar to point that domain over to Landerbolt. So we'll just go ahead and copy these over really quick. And obviously this is the DNS settings of your registrar. Just find your name servers and this is what you'll change. Keep in mind whenever you change your name servers, everything else is gonna be, you know, you're not gonna have access to a website if you have one. So make sure that domain is not being used for anything important before you do this. Typically you'll wanna just purchase a new domain and then do this. So that's how you do that. So that is added now over on the Landerbolt side. So I can close my registrar. I don't need to use that anymore. That is now active here, right here at the top. And what we can do now is if we wanna add subdomains. So if we wanna have you know diff a few different subdomains using that same domain, we can do that. So if we have uh, products that we wanna promote on the affiliate side that are maybe like in weight loss or we could do like health as one and then we could add tech you know if we're doing tech landing pages so we can add the, those uh, subdomains really quick and easy right on there and then if we want to create a new page all we have to do is click this create page button and I'm going to show you how to do uh, one from a URL so for instance I have Clickbank open here and I found research maybe you want to come on Clickbank and find some products to promote and you need to find some landing pages to use uh, you can find an offer I found this one here I found this this page that I'm just going to use as a demo. I just Google search research review. I'm not sure if this is the official page or not. What you can do is just find other affiliate pages out there to go ahead and copy and then edit into your own style or whatever you want to do. So I'm just going to go ahead and use this as an example. So we're just going to copy the URL and then we're going to paste that into here URL to import and then we're going to call this research review and then we'll add health there for the category and then we'll choose the the domain we want to use and this is going to be help so that's where you can choose that subdomain that we added and then the folder name i like to just do we'll just do review so you could do home or you know free report if it's like a, a download for a pdf or something like that uh, so we'll just go ahead and create the page and now lander bolt will work and it's going to copy everything over onto this domain from uh, this other website right here just using the url so we'll just go ahead and wait for that to finish so it says page created successfully and then what we can do is just go ahead and we can either go to the visual editor and edit it or we can just go ahead and publish it and then it will give you the URL here. So you can see now uh, this page is on my domain health.debthelp.io slash review. 
So this is, and all these links here are still going to the same links that were on, that were on this on this site. You can see down here in the bottom left. So what we've done is copied that 100% over, um, and you can edit those. You can edit those pages links really simply if you want to. What you can do is you can come into the visual editor and it's gonna bring it up right down here. We could do this link replacer. So we can go ahead and replace all the links on the page with our own. So if I wanted to promote this research, I could just go ahead and click promote. And we'll just generate a hop link over on ClickBank. And then we'll just go ahead and place place this here I'll just go ahead and save that I'm gonna go ahead and exit these other pages so now if I just come up here and reload this page and I go ahead and click buy now you'll notice down in the left you can see that that is my link now so that changes all the links on the page instantly now. So you can see down in the bottom left there, it shows that test. And if I go ahead and click that, it shows my hop link TFS2006. So that is my ID for ClickBank. And so that copied that website right over. And you can, like I like I said, you can go ahead and change your, your, your links on, on all the pages instantly like that really quick. You'll notice down here, uh, affiliate, is TFS2006 and then uh, the ID is test which is what we set so that is how you build a landing page from somebody else's page instantly just using the URL the other cool thing now is you can do file uploads if you're inside my affiliate master files course you can go ahead and upload all those landing pages that I that I give away in there uh, right now it's just one-time fee and you can get all those landing pages to upload and edit how you want put your own affiliate links in there those are pages that i've tested and been using for a couple years some of them a few years now so they're tested pages so if you guys haven't checked that out go ahead and, and head over to alternativeentrepreneur.com and it's just called affiliate master files so you can check that out let's go ahead and upload a website here so if i just wanted to upload a i have a website sales page here so this is this is what it looks like right here this is just the local file uh, but what we can do now with with lander bolt is just go ahead and zip the folder and then go ahead and drop it in here and then give it a name test test and then we'll just go ahead and throw it on a domain i've already created one because i've done another one of these pages uh, for meditation so we'll just go ahead and use that same subdomain and we'll just do test on that for the folder and then we'll go ahead and create it and now it's just going to pull that upload that file from our computer so which is really handy because if you have a website that you've downloaded or something you want to re-upload this is a really quick way to do it instantly so now we can just go ahead and click publish and then we can go ahead and click the link and you'll see here my domain avoidstress.app slash test and everything is here so that's how you do that so that really quick and easy to upload right to Landerbolt. so those are kind of some of the main up updates with Landerbolt. Uh, if you have any more questions go ahead and leave them down below i might do some more in-depth videos on this or just some more playing around with Landerbolt in the future if you'd like to see that let me know uh, make sure to check out my link down below for Landerbolt. right now they are doing the 47 dollars a month so this is new it was uh, i think the lowest price was 99 for a very minimum version of it and then it went all the way up to 300 a month this is the 47 dollar a month count so i wanted to give it a test and everything's working working great uh you can get a discount if you do tracking uh through volume uh, and they give you a discount if you want to if you want to sign up with that and they also have templates that you can use so if you wanted to you know create a product to promote or a sales page bridge page sweepstakes page you know all these different things for affiliate marketing you can just go ahead and select a template and then go ahead and make a name for it put it on a domain and then start editing it right away one thing i'll show you real quick i go back into the settings here and i go to the visual editor the visual editor has improved a lot than what it was before so now you can just come in here and it's really easy to change things so do that and you know add anything that you want in here 
You can change these images out if you want. You can go ahead and upload a new one. Very easy to do. And you can also view the source. So you can see the HTML. And then you can do uh, on Mac, it's Command F. So if you want to do a search right here. So if I wanted to find a certain URL or something like that, you could do a search inside there and replace it really quick and easy. Um, so that is Landerbolt kind of the update. Like I said, I might be doing some more uh, playing around with Landerbolt because I've been using this for over a year now and I love it. I would really take advantage of this $47 a month uh, right now because they didn't used to include all this with the $99 a month version of it. So check that out. I'm not sure when that'll be ending. Link will be down below. I uh, appreciate it. If you guys want to go ahead and subscribe, I really appreciate the support and make sure to hit that bell so you don't miss any videos that I upload. And like I said, if you want to check out the affiliate, the affiliate master, files it's just over alternative entrepreneur.com if you come up here to uh, all courses and then right here affiliate master files you can go ahead and download a bunch of my my landing pages and they're all zip files so that you can go ahead and upload those if you're going to use Landerbolt and then go ahead and edit them and put your own affiliate links in there and stuff like that so subscribe if you found this valuable and we'll see you in the next video guys cheers